up you guys my name is Liz and welcome back to another video of my YouTube channel I am back baby Woo! I'm so excited to be back here and I thought we would start today with what do you call it coming back video something like that so as some of you already have noticed I have been gone for quite a while it had to do with a lot of issues but I will talk about that when I start doing my makeup so as you guys can already tell by the title of this video and the lack of makeup on my face I'm going to be doing my makeup today for the heck of it and to film other parts of certain videos everything will be explained while I do the makeup so I feel like I've got a long way to go so let's get started first things first I bought this new headband at, a, at TJ Maxx very cute it was like four dollars for this I'm gonna be using this to take the hair out of my face and cut to me putting this on Okay, so now that we look classy, cute, adorable, and comfy, and have all the hair out of my face, I am going to start with everything. So I thought that it would be a good idea for me to address some issues that came up with my videos and everything. So as you all know, we have been dealing with this coronavirus stuff for quite like a few days already. It's been quite a while. I don't know, I just figured that it would be a good idea to come back to YouTube and stuff like that. I left for a little bit because of some personal issues that I had with myself, like lack of confidence, lack of, what do you call it? It's like mm, motivation lack of motivation so i experience that like very often normally whenever i start something <laughs> can you see i look like a freaking like raccoon or something <laughs> anyways i experience a lot of lack of motivation with a lot of stuff that i do so when i'm like acting or like modeling and stuff like that none of those things that i'm working on are things that have stayed with me i haven't gone much like far from anything because i just i don't know i think it's like something that i have that causes me to not be okay with the place that I am in life like I want everything to be so fast and quick I'm like basically ranting to you guys right now but I have realized that it is an issue for me because I don't know I always want something to go like super fast you know like I want to grow fast and be like that and be like those people from snapchat <laughs> snapchat no um be like those people from like tiktok and stuff which by the way I got a tiktok but I haven't used it because I one I don't know how to do that and two I'm very bad when it comes to trends and I don't do any of that I'm like I don't know I'm a weird person I like to read books listen to rock music lay down on my ass and sleep on my bed I don't know I thought that it would be a good idea to get back on the horse that I left a long time ago and you know be the happy self that I used to be any hoozy so I thought that I would come back and be my normal self again why am I doing this like I'm gonna put foundation over it right now I, I probably did something wrong but as you can tell, my makeup skills have not gotten any better. As a matter of fact, I think they've gotten worse. So I was editing, so here's the thing. I started feeling like this because I was editing one video that is probably gonna, that is prob, I can't talk, well, that is probably gonna be coming out next week or something like that. Yeah, once a week I'm probably gonna be doing this because I suffer from a lack of motivation on a lot of stuff. So I was editing this video and it's a video that I, <laughs> I was my dumb self actually literally forgot to grab the camera when I went to LA and I filmed that actually like about a month or two ago. Yeah, I was editing it and it just really, really bothered me like how I looked how the video was coming out like i was having a lot of issues with it too like not being able to how can i say it wow wow this concealer is good i was having a i was basically having a lot of issues when it came to dealing with this kind of stuff so when i went to la i left my camera here home by accident and i had to film on my phone and that caused for myself to look really bad on camera because there's a reason why i hardly post on instagram y'all my phone camera sucks so it always makes me either look too big or my skin looks really bad and in this video it was exactly what i knew would it would be you know it would be like literal bad case of uh, terrible filming skills or whatever terrible camera so okay so yeah that happened and it caused me to be very insecure feel very 
bad about coming out on camera and stuff like that so i had to take a break from social media and stuff like that so i stopped being active while well, i was active i was like liking pictures and stuff like that but i never came out on camera or on instagram or on tiktok like stuff like that and then the quarantine happened <laughs> i filmed two videos two videos like this so right after the second video was filmed i felt really bad about how i looked in that one too so i ended up deciding to stop the way that i felt about myself was not helping me in any way shape or form so i ended up not quitting youtube but like taking a break from it because it really 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 upset me so i was having issues with the way that i looked my image and stuff like that i still want to change my image like my outfits and stuff but everything like i don't know i just felt insecure so i stopped and then well i'm being very honest with you guys and i'm not gonna hide stuff like this from you because these issues are real a lot of people have the same issues with like they deal with the same things the same stuff oh my god why is it so itchy right now oh okay so a lot of people have the same issue i still have it it's took me a while to actually begin filming this video before posting the other two videos that i'm gonna be posting like after this one i wanted to make a video that explained why i was gone most of the time and why nobody had heard from me why i just left without saying goodbye or like saying that i was gonna take a break but i don't know i realized that that was a really bad thing to do and i apologize i sincerely apologize to you guys for that but yeah i am back <laughs> I look like crap <laughs> it's better to laugh at yourself and learn from that you will learn eventually that you are beautiful in your own way and if you think that you're not beautiful at the moment then you'll get over it I know super inspirational right no but I really 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 felt like I needed some help or, or like to just take a break because nothing was coming out the way that I wanted it to then quarantine happened and well I thought why not why not get back to it since you know most of you guys are at home right now chilling watching whatever you guys can and you know sitting on your butts bored out of your mind like i get it i get it but the only thing is i do that most of the time so for me it's not an issue but like i'm a major introvert so basically i am literally somebody who is introverted who doesn't like to go out who doesn't like to post things and yet i am here filming for you guys and you know i had like this whole thing that i was gonna be talking about and now that i'm doing my makeup it kind of just left i don't know i lose my mindset every time that i do this kind of stuff so yeah i am transforming myself while talking to you guys on a tangent most of you people don't know me but i'm being vulnerable i guess and relatable i hope while also looking cute with my little bow i love it <laughs> i also have a mike wazowski headband too Got that at Disney, part of one of the videos, which I also already, you know, spoiled for you guys. But yeah, that's probably gonna be the video that comes uh, that comes out like probably two weeks from now, probably. But honestly, I'm bored out of my mind and I have no idea what the hell I'm doing. I'm just gonna do my makeup the best way that I can with a different look than I have already had before. So you guys will see if I turn out like a clown or not. <laughs> This quarantine has been really bad on a lot of you. I, I know it's pretty boring sometimes. I'm actually still working. A lot of you are not working right now and I'm st I still am. So for me, it doesn't feel like it's a quarantine. For me, it's just like any regular day. When I don't work, I stay home normally. So, so <laughs> it's not really changing for me. But the only thing that is different is that now I have to wear a mask when I come out. So it's not really an issue. All right, so let's get to the important and fun stuff. I don't know what colors I'm gonna be making. I have all of these from my Sephora owl thingy that my mom gave me a long time ago, but I have all of these. Plus I have the Naked 3 palette and the Naked Heat palette. You know what, let's do something crazy. Let's do something crazy, here I go. You guys will tell me how bad this looks later on. Anyways, it's been shaking up in here. Like we've literally been having so many earthquakes and I'm scared for my life, y'all. Like I really, really don't want to keep living here, but I guess that's the price. It's so, so shaky. Like, earthquake after earthquake after earthquake for two days straight it's been quaking i'm not I'm not kidding i'm complaining this whole video is probably going to be me complaining do you guys realize that we're in the middle of the apocalypse and i'm over here doing my makeup yeah you need to look fabulous for the apocalypse 
You cannot see this yellow. This is gonna take me forever, so I'm just gonna fast forward through this part because I don't think you're, I'm ever gonna be able to achieve the yellow look that I want. So I'm gonna try it, fast forward, and then see if that works now. By the way guys, this actually took me like a little bit over 30 minutes just to get the color and shade that I wanted for that look. So I think I have just finished blending the yellow. Let me see if I can find a color that can mix in with the yellow. Mm. Oh yeah, okay, so there's like this really nice darker gold that I'm probably gonna be doing at the edges and before I go in with the black and stuff like that. So I'm gonna use that. This is a much darker color, still shimmery, but darker. I can already tell that this this look is gonna look so bad. Oh my God, this looks green. It almost looks green, but it's yellow. That's so weird. So, oh my God, this is gonna look so bad. And I don't think you guys can even see the look that I have on my face. No, but in person, it's a lot of yellow. Pure yellow is not gonna work with this. I have to do like, Okay, only yellow and black is not gonna work, so I need to add another color. So I think I'm gonna add like a darker, like a little brown, like bronze, a bronze, and then I'm gonna do black because nothing else is gonna work for me if I keep doing yellow and yellow and yellow and yellow and yellow and it's not gonna work. So yeah, I already put on my face like five colors on me. I'm going into the, do the contour right now. It probably, <laughs> my face looks like crap. I told you guys, I'm not that good with makeup, but you know, eventually I'll get better. I really, really want to grow. Like, I want one of those plaques, those YouTube plaques, and I want to put them on the wall and stuff like that. I really want to look like that. That's my new goal. I want a YouTube plaque. <laughs> so if you've stayed this far into the video, then make sure to hit the like button and subscribe to my channel because it will really help me get to that the amount of followers that I need so that I can get a plaque. Yeah, you guys will really be helping me out if you do hit that subscribe button and the notification bell too so that you guys can know when I actually post a video now. <laughs> I'm very excited. I want to reach that goal of like the 1,000 followers, 1,000 subscribers or something like that. So I'm going to be posting a lot more often. I'm going to be posting every Wednesday. So let's do this. All right, give me a sec while I finish my contour because I know that I can't really talk when I do that. Okay, I'm going to do the other one. Now that I'm almost done with my makeup, I feel like I'm closing a video and stuff like that, but who knows? So anyways, yeah, you guys really should tell me if you like the video, yeah. like this video, and follow me on Instagram and follow me on TikTok. I will post those right here. And yeah, um, I will be posting on, on TikTok soon, I feel like, because I want to actually learn how to do those dances they're pretty cool all right so face is done now i gotta do my i feel like i'm i feel like using some eyelashes i'm gonna do that i'm gonna do that i'm gonna put some eyelashes on so the ones that i like are multi-layered 3d effect lashes you can get these at ulta and stuff like that so they're 3d eyelashes so that means that they're like fuller than the other normal lashes that you would get. Again, I had to fast forward through this part because it took me around 30 minutes also to just put the eyelashes on and they weren't getting on correctly, so yeah. All right, so now that I finally got these two on, this one gave me a lot more problems, I am finally gonna do the final look, which is the lip. And we're done. This is the look, guys. Let me bring it like a closer look for you guys to see me. All right, so this is how I look now. Did not require any eyeliner, but I'm so excited to be back and I'm gonna try to do the best to keep you guys entertained while this entire thing blows over and we can go back to the streets soon enough. Hope you guys have a wonderful, wonderful, wonderful day. Um, stay safe, stay inside, be responsible, wash your hands at least 20 seconds, of course, like always, and wear a mask when you go, when you go out. Take care of yourselves, I love you guys so much, and I will see you guys next week. <laughs> Bye!